Today is Wednesday, July 22nd, uh, 2020, and I just wanted to put this quick video together to thank uh, everyone who's helped us out in the last year, and I would say especially so in the last six months, uh, the Sports Shares programs, everybody who uh, was owed packages and such from the shutdown should have received an email from the Pitney Bowes mailing system, or maybe two of them, uh, that those are the tracking numbers for all of the packages that were sent out um, yesterday and, and a couple uh, more this morning. So all of that is the, uh, the remaining prize drawing materials. If you remember, there were some of those, including the uh, New York Times copies signed by Zach, uh, a couple of swag bags, actually three swag bags, uh, and a couple of other things. So that stuff all went out. So the purpose of this video is I just want to give a little bit of a backstory. Um, those of you who are big getting those packages, looks like the U.S. deliveries will be by the end of the week. Uh, some of the international ones are going to take longer. There's, there's quite a number to Canada and also to Europe. Um, so those will take a little longer. So I want to explain what happened here. Um, I've been communicating with you about the production of the remaining balances of sports shares. And it's really been a comedy of things that have happened. Um, I actually got a new, uh, a new laser printer, new, new um, uh, printing stock and all of this. And just for days and days could not get the, um, the, 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 the stock to feed into the laser printer, the stuff I've been using forever, even on multiple printers. Just absolutely nuts um, spending a few days trying to do that. So what I did was I took the entire, I hit a, a pretty large pile of, um, of all of the, the material that I had produced for the orders that were pending and uh, a little bit of extra overstock of some of the others. I uh, put it all together in a pile and I mixed it together and I divided it equally amongst uh, all of the packages. So what you have is uh, you have a random sample of what I had left. Uh, that's what you're going to get. So some people are going to get more. Some people are going to get a, bit, a little bit less, although there's really only a couple of orders that were really large uh, orders. Uh, you know, So most people are going to get more than they actually were expecting. But to make up for that, uh, in either case, um, all of you already know this, but you receive some extra bonus margin funds in your accounts, which would be well beyond uh, what you would have received for credit to uh, to your accounts for those sports shares and the sports folio points, um, you know the sports folio rewards, blockchain, all of that stuff. It's in a, it's larger than that. You already know that because it's been posted to your account. Uh, and in addition to that, so so nobody's going to be shortchanged in terms of that stuff. Um, and also there's a little surprise in there. In turn, it's it's a it's a mock-up of the of the cover of the book which I'm still working on, and I've actually decided not to not to put it out in this July 4th, just because the, uh, the national mood is wrong. The, the conditions for marketing um, something on July 4th were completely wrong. I, I was watching that over the last few months as uh, things deteriorated with the lockdown and all of that. And it just doesn't feel like the right moment. Even just, uh, I was watching how the stores around here put out their July 4th Independence Day promotional stuff. And, and they didn't, uh, or they put out very little, which is really surprising, like in Target, and such, they really, it was a very muted promotion of that stuff. And I've watched this uh, for many years now, and, and actually at this specific Target. So I know that in the strategy department of Target, uh, in the messaging, public messaging and marketing, they came to the same conclusion I did, that this is not really a rah, rah, rah kind of season. So uh, that's why I pulled back on that and only released the cover page and the, and the, and the chapter titles. So... Um, it just doesn't feel the moment isn't right. I'm, I'm going to, you know, we need to let, I don't know if Christmas is the right moment. It may not be, but I'm waiting to see the, the conditions improve before I consider an actual public uh, release of the book and marketing campaign and PR campaign that go along with that. So the timing is wrong. So in sum, all those packages are uh, in the mail. You're going to, you, you have the emails. Uh, nobody got shortchanged. If any of you are unhappy with the, um, what you end up with for any reason, for any reason whatsoever, if you're not happy with uh, the uh, what you got versus what you were expecting, then please write me an email. You certainly know how to reach me because I communicate with you all the time. Um, so thank you very much. Please stay safe with your friends and your family. And once again, thank you so very much for sticking by us. 
especially through uh, the last year, because that's really when we started the Sports Shares program was about about this point last year. Uh, but the, in, in the last six months or seven months during the lockdown and all this uh, chaos that's, that's been going on, um, you know, you're the reason that we're still here for the benefit of all of our stockholders, uh, I would like to mention, not just for you guys. So those few that are um, still here are the ones that are holding it together for everybody else. So I hope you enjoy the little happy package, uh, you know, in this not so happy time. And once again, thank you very much for everything and know that the team is very uh, hard at work behind the scenes to make everything work out. Thank you again and uh, have a great evening. Bye now.